Hello guys, welcome back to Good Shower Tips. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix computer appear to be correctly configured, but device or resources is not responding and how to fix this up. So let's get started. So first thing what you have to do is you have to go to the CMD. You have to search for CMD over here. You have to search for command prompt. Then you have to go for run as administrator and go for yes. Now you have to give hardly around some of the commands. So I'll be giving that commands in the description so you don't have to worry. So uh, these are the commands which is IP config flush DNS, IP config register DNS and network win sock reset, net SHIND IP reset and IP config renew. So you have to do all these one by one. So this is very really quite simple and as you know that you have to try out each you have to uh, copy and paste and press enter so I am not going to show that part. So I will be giving you in the description so you can copy it one by one so it is not wasting much time. And once after trying this, if the issue is not solved, then you have to go for the next one, which is you have to press Windows and R key all together to get the run command. And you have to go for ncpa.cpl. You have to go for ncpa.cpl and press OK. Now it will take you to this. As you can see that I have connected to the Wi-Fi, so I have to go to the properties. And from the properties, I have to uh, scroll down a little bit and I have to go to select Internet Protocol version. Now I have to go to the properties once again. And from sure, I have to make sure that it is connected to obtain an IP address automatically as well as obtain DNS server address automatically and I have to go for OK. And if it's not working, you know, after that, if it's not working, then you don't have to worry. You have to go it once again to the Internet Protocol version 4 TCP bar IPv4 and you have to go to properties. And now you have to give the uh, the US, uh, you know, you have to go click on use the following DNS server address where you have to give for here. This is the values are 88, eight, sorry, it is 8, 8, you have to go for 8, and the values are 8. In the same way for uh, the alternative DNS server, you have to give 8, you have to go for 8, and it is 4, and it is 4. You have to go for this one and go for OK, and most probably the issue will be fixed. If it's not working, then we're going to talk about the next step. So the next step is all about, you know, you have to uh, search here on the uh, search bar. You have to search for Intel. Uh, you have to search for Intel. Uh, sorry, not Intel. Init uh, CPL dot CPL. You have to search for this and press enter. And now from here, the first thing what you have to do is you have to go here in the connections and from here you have to click on LAN setting and make sure it is on not on this one if it is not a UC proxy service for LAN. So you know you have to make sure it is not to this and if it is on to this also make sure by going to the start you have to click over here and you have to go to uh, you know you have to go to here over uh, you know you have to go to uh, I mean you have to go to the Wi-Fi options and you have to check yourself whether the issue is solved or not. So you have to go back and from here you have to go to the network and internet and from here you have to click on proxy and make sure this is on and also when it comes to down if the manual proxy setup you have to make sure this is turn it off. Okay you have to make sure this is turn it off or else you'll be having this issue. And now closing on to this we have to go for the next one which is all about you know we have to do the same over here you have to search for the same which is uh, init cpl dot cpl and you have to press uh, enter and now you have to go for uh, advanced and uh, now from here you have to go to advanced and you have to click on rest, uh, reset advanced settings you have to go for reset and you know while uh, doing the reset you know this will be making so delete personal data you have to tick this up and go for the reset so I am not going to that part you have to click here and uh, you know you have to restart your computer so you have to do and most probably you know this will be fixing the issue up and also apart from that you have to go for the device manager which is one of the basic step so you have to go to the device manager and now from here you have to go to network adapters you have to find network adapters and as you can see that I am connected to the Wi-Fi so it is the wireless LAN card is so you have to right click on this and go to properties and now from here you have to go to power management and make sure you have to untick this you have to untick this and go for ok and also apart from that if it's not working then you have to click on this once again and go to properties and sorry you have to click this and go for uninstall the devices and reinstall it once again and most probably check out most probably the issue regarding the computer appeared to be correctly configured but device or res uh, resources is not responding will be completely fixed 
And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. Any doubts to ask in the comment sessions, we will get back to you. And this is Shahin officially signing off from Getsetips. Keep practice social distance, be safe, and stay safe.